I'm William Mock, and I'm with Foster's Pine Plate in Rockford, Arkansas. Today we are going to be doing a New Orleans style barbecue shrimp. You want a medium to hot pan. Uh, you know, you don't want to burn your house down, but you want to make sure you get a nice caramelization on the things that you're sauteing. A little bit of oil. We're going to add our shrimp. These are shrimp from the Gulf of Mexico. We'll add shallot. Very important, fresh chopped rosemary. Garlic at the end. Very important, you do not burn your garlic. It can burn very, very easily. So the shrimp are about half cooked. You glaze with beer. We're using uh, Foster's Red Ale we make here in here at Foster's. Worcestershire hot sauce. Fresh squeezed lemon. Okay, now you can drop your heat down to just barely a simmer. You can even turn it off if you have to. So what we're going to do is we're going to start adding our unsalted butter. And you just add it in a little bit at a time and stir it. And so you're going to end up using probably four ounces, maybe a little more, depending on how much sugar you're making. Now if your heat's on too hot, all it's going to do is break. So you're just going to have a puddle of oil instead of a nice shiny sauce. So we have our shrimp and we have our grits. The grits are pretty simple. Don't buy instant. It's a four to one ratio. You use four parts of milk to one part of grit. Wait till it boils for grit and season it butter before. So these are our cheese grits that we have here at Foster's. And then so your shrimp just simply go on top of the grits. Finish it off with a little bit of sauce. Make sure you get some of that rosemary and that garlic in there as well. This is our New Orleans style shrimp and grits at Foster's Pine Plate. For more information, go to nwahomepage.com.